We're going to head back out one last time to the Fraser Museum with Nyla Spencer. So we're having a great time here at the Fraser Museum learning all about the Barrels of Heart exhibit that's coming right here next month. I'm super excited about it. So, you know, we've heard from the artists, we've heard from some of the community partners, but I want to touch on, you know, all the hands that went into making this event come together. One interesting thing that I just learned is that you all partnered with Tops Louisville and you all are going to have a spread. Tell me about that. Um, yes, yeah, so we, Kathy is editor of Tops Magazine, and we're going to have 22 page spread. Every artist has a full page with their sponsor and their barrel. Um, so 22 page spread, it will almost be a magazine of its own. Yes, I think that is great, and especially highlighting all of these local artists. Why was it important for you guys to cover this? Well, it, Topps Magazine is a big supporter of the arts as well as the bourbon industry. And we just really felt like um, it was a great platform for us to feature the artists uh, with all their different stories and the stories that they're painting on the barrels. So we feel very honored and um, we're excited to release the February issue. Yes, it's gonna be super exciting. And so, you know, we are here with one of the artists. Um, we saw your work just a second ago. And I think what's really cool off camera you told me you just picked up a paintbrush in 2017 yes. and now you're in this art exhibit and you oh, even no. are going to be um, featured in uh, Topps magazine how does that wow. feel it's very exciting um, it's I'm thrilled to be in Topps of course and to be a part of the exhibit but I think more importantly for me is that you know when I first started painting in 2017 I heard if you have a gift give it away mm -hmm. so for me it's just so incredibly exciting to be able to use my art to give back to the community through the charities and as mentioned it's going to be hosted right here the Fraser Museum so we have the man with the plan so Andy tell me you know about this partnership again how does it feel to be actually hosting it well speaking as giving back a gift I mean Morgan came to us just a couple of months ago with this idea and I mean so much respect for what you've done this has all come together in a limited amount of time our mission is to ignite the human spirit with thoughtfully thoughtfully crafted stories mm -hmm. every one of these artists is telling a story and we are just thrilled as the official starting point of the Kentucky Bourbon Trail to bring these barrels here and to bring them to the public. We're excited. We're going to have an opening event on February 1st. The day after that, it opens to the public and it'll be open for anyone to see for an eight week run. Oh, I'm excited. I'm definitely going to have to visit. So if people want to get more details, more information, where's the best way for them to go to you, get that? You can go to Morgan's website or you can go to our website where there will be a detailed description of the exhibit and that's FraserMuseum.org. Awesome. Thank you so much for being with us here today and we're going to send it right back to you, Claudia.